Hey guys, I want to do a quick review uh, for two baseball caps, two black baseball caps from Gucci. One is genuine, one is not. Uh, the one I actually bought from Gucci.com, the other one I bought from eBay. Now the seller on eBay told me that the item is genuine, hence why I bought it for a large sum of money. But upon close inspection, I found out the item is not genuine. Now I'll show you the differences so in the future you guys can be better aware. Now the one on the top, the golden box, is the fake Gucci. The one on the left, the black and white, is the genuine one. I'll be doing a side by side comparison, uh, you'll see. So basically the genuine one was neatly packed in this black strap with this black strap uh, that has Gucci written on it. It's pretty neat actually. Uh, okay, let's start. So as you can see, I actually unpacked this before and it's not as tidy as it was when I got it. But for the sake of this, let's just say that I do my best. Okay, um, so the real one is one left, the fake one is one on the right. Now the real one came with the receipt it came with a thank you from shopping with us at gucci.com came with this little i think it's like a care a care for your cap there's a couple of languages in there i see arabic i'm guessing this is italian i'm not 100 percent sure excuse me if i'm wrong now before i review the cap let's review the bags that the caps came in so all gucci bags come with a dust bag this is the one for the real one. This is the fake one. First thing you'll notice is that they're different in color. And yes, they are. The genuine one is dark brown with golden letters, G-U-C-C-I, that actually pop out at you so you realize that you're buying a Gucci item. The fake one is a dark brown, moderate brown color, and you can barely see the Gucci written on there. Uh, as you can see, there are straps. So when you pull these, pull this bag will get tighter hence why it's a dust bag so your uh, so your cap doesn't you know get dirty or whatever uh, the fake one has the same thing however the fake one there is a little knot here the real one should not have a knot on there again this is as far as my personal experience goes now let's go now let's get to the good stuff the caps now if you only had one of these caps it'll be hard to explain no, which one is the genuine, which one's the real one. But I'll do a quick review and a quick comparison and you'll know which one is what. Alright, so the real one. First thing to notice. The stitching, there are three stitches here. One very close to the rim and then two right here. And as you can see, you can barely see it. You can barely see it, but... They're very big, and the reason why you barely see it is because they're very tight and thin stitches. Now, the reason why I'm showing you this is because the fake one is different. Here is why it's different. You can clearly see the stitching. It's very thick, fat, tight. Well, it's not barely tight, but th thick stitching. There are three stitches. You can see all three of them in a genuine Gucci cap. You will not be able to see all those three stitches unless you closely inspect it. So this is thicker stitching. That one was not. The second difference that's very easily spot is first off, these are their parts essentially. So they were stitched together to make a cap. So as you can see, the G's on the left and on the right of the stitching, they're mirrored, almost perfectly mirrored. However, in the fake one, they were not. So, as you can see, there are, it's a little up and down, up and down. There's a slight difference in height, but yeah, you won't have that in actual Gucci cap. The next difference is another part of the stitching, which is the stitching right here. It extends from the top and it goes right beside, all the way to the bottom. From right beside this uh, green red green signature strap. Whereas in the fake one. 
it does run from the top and as you can see it's thicker stitching but the point is there is no stitching here beside the green red green that's another thing so those are the ones on top more or less if you flip it over flip this one over the first thing well, the first quick difference is this is a black interior if you're if you buy a black cap you will get a black interior this is a black cap with a brown interior so you should not have that all right so now the tags this tag this is the tag that it came with this is what it looks like now the fake one there's a plastic part here that says Gucci Min Italy. It should not have that. Also, it, no, it should not have this part either. It should look like the one I saw, showed you before. The next quick difference is the tags inside. So, as you can see, there's one tag that says Gucci Min Italy. Uh, what it's made of, how it's cared for, etc., etc. Uh, the size is written at the very bottom, so I got a medium for myself. For this one, as you can see, the first thing is the size is on the top. Now, that's on how it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be at the very bottom. And as you can see, there's a smaller strap behind under this. Now, the original one, it was two long straps. This one, there's barely thick. They're pretty small, actually. Uh, upon closer inspection, you can see that where it says medium in Italy, it's not properly written. Like, there's like little dots in between. Uh, and the other thing is, see the spacing between the Gu Chi? It kind of says Gak Chi or Gak Si Ai. Uh, they're supposed to have equal spacing between them or pretty close spacing between them. As you can see in this Gucci cap, the genuine one. That's another difference. Now, all genuine caps come with cereals. Now, the replicas have gotten so good that even they put cereals on there. But the best way to, dif to defer is to look at the cereal and to inspect it. Like, this is the genuine one. And see how it's written. It's very neat. And it's very clean. I'm not sure if that's the best way to describe it, but I'm going to go with that. Whereas in the fake one, as you can see, it's not the same way. It's more shiny, um, the leather itself is very shiny in comparison to this one. It's a subtler sh type of shiny, I guess. I'm not sure, I'm not good with those kind of terms. Uh, the other thing that you may have noticed is on this buckle, in the fake one, it says Gucci on the buckle. It says G-U-C-C-I on both on top and bottom. Whereas in the genuine one, it does not. So that's another difference. All in all, those are the ones that I could easily spot. I'm sure there may be other experts out there that may be able to spot better things. Uh, one quick thing, but I don't know if you can actually spot this, is we, the green red grin strap on the genuine one is more thinner than the fake one. And on the fake one, there's another deep stitching on there. So I'm not sure if you guys will be able to be able to spot that unless you can compare between a genuine and a fake one but these are the more easily seen uh, problems essentially so you can compare which one is genuine which one is not again the worksmanship of this is actually really good of course you're paying for it but yeah it's really good whereas in the fake one it's really rough honestly it's really it's really not the best thing there is. I'm setting it back. I made an eBay claim because the item is fake. Whereas the seller told me the item is genuine. Hopefully I'll get my money back. Anyways guys, I hope I can help you. I could have helped you. And if I did, uh, thank you so much. I apologize for my camera. It's my phone. I'm a student. So you can understand I use my phone a lot. Uh, if you have any questions, please do write it down. Or put it on the comments. I'll try to reply as soon as I can. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.